Welcome to the vlog, I'm Laika and um, today I'll probably get some writing done which is basically just me staring at a computer and figuring out what to write since I can probably crank out like the setting in a script and that's called that's still writing so yeah I'll probably do that and start on um a scene that's not in a questioning room More like a park, maybe, maybe. Oh, I need to brush my hair. Number one. Number two is um, I need to change out of this clothes. So probably wear my Adidas. Yeah. So I realize I Tom Holland did my script. Whoops. Um spoilers. But um I like talking about my stuff at short films that I write. And I like talking about them with you guys since I like to see what you guys think. But that makes it a community project when I want to do it on my own. So I'm I'm basically documenting my writing process in a vlog such as this one. So in um I'm gonna talk about the Brotherhood. <laughs> so in the Brotherhood they mentioned Anne Boleyn, the Bronte sisters. And they mention um, theater actress Claire Luz, which is um, an actress who fell off a table and broke something in her body. Yeah, so that's who they mention um, in the Brotherhood, and they're all women um, who does their things well, and Claire is a theater actress, as I said before, and she is like one of the people that I researched for the Brotherhood and writing Brotherhood, having them mentioned, giving them a different light, and through the eyes of feminism, that's what the Brotherhood talks about those women through the light of feminism. So, like, three guys, you'll get their opinions on these women. And I've assigned 
the guy to a specific his figure in history. L literature, history, theater history, um, and historical figures of mm, British history, like Anne Boleyn and the Bronte sisters and Claire Luce, but all names in British history. So I'm listening to an audiobook as I write The Brotherhood. So I'm listening to the Bronte sisters' poems as an audiobook. And I'm also researching poems that I can find online that is Bronte written, written by a Bronte sister, and yeah. Dylan. You get screen time. We love you, Dylan. Love you, Dylan. So I'm having my lunch to burrito. The microwave for 30 seconds. Yeah. Just to get on, just to talk about this. Um, if you like Bridgerton, then why um, rave about a work of art that's not even a series? Like, you rave about a movie that, um, hardly anyone cares about because it's for children and it's rated PG. And a lot of people watch PG-13 movies and not PG movies. And the majority always, always finds themselves watching movies meant for 13 plus, you know? And Bridgerton is no exception of that rule. A lot of people watched it, a lot of people seen it, a lot of people has opinions, and it's made primarily by a black woman who produced it. It's Shonda Rhimes. Like, I'm a fan of Shonda's. Her series is amazing. She did Grey's Anatomy, I think. Um, she has a series um, on Netflix, which is Bridgerton. And Bridgerton is one of those series that I enjoy watching. And I don't rape about my opinions on it because I know the fact that it's um, honoring the books and the books is...
a lot slower pace than the series. I haven't read the books. I just seen the series, so I can't give my opinion on it. So I have to wrap presents. Um, there's two presents. It's just small, so I can make do with. The gift wrapped that has a bit left in there. Wrapped. Just finished wrapping presents again. Yeah, so yeah, that's it. So I'll end the vlog right here. I'll see you guys in the next one. Ciao.